My name is Mike Kirkalonis, the owner of Poplar Hill Machine in Conway, Massachusetts. Uh, we specialize in microwave components. Uh, we've been in business for about five years now. Um, we just moved out of our garage where we started uh, about two years ago. We're into a new facility, it's about 8,500 square feet. What's unique about Poplar Hill Machine is, is some of the things that we, we produce here. We think we have a niche over the general uh, machine shops that are out there because of our method of manufacturing. Some of the components that we make are for the telecommunications industry. Um, and we go down to a 5,000 diameter end mill all the time. And some of those features we can't deburr at all. So um, we have a, a certain method of manufacturing that we use to make these parts. This is an example of uh, one of the components that we make. It's another one of our microwave parts. Um, some of the wave guys that are in here are very particular. We go down to a 5,000 diameter end mill with this as well. Um, once again, you can't have any birds on these parts. Um, we're splitting uh, tents on these parts all day long. We have one customer right now that's uh, developing this. It's part of a, uh, a radar system for the military, for the U.S. Navy. As I mentioned before, we specialize in parts that we can't deburr. Um, and inside these small waveguides, these little features for electronics to be plugged into. Um, they looked uh, around New England for somebody to do these, and they happened to come to us and uh, they've been very pleased with us. Hi, my name is John Hill. I'm the manufacturing engineer for Poplar Hill Machine. Uh, my main responsibilities here is the CAD CAM and programming for the CNC machines down in the shop. I started out originally using another CAD CAM package and it was very difficult to use. It was uh, very hard to manipulate the tool path. I did a lot of the training online and the thing that was nice about the online training was that I could go at my own pace. I could go back and review things and if I wanted to I could actually follow along with examples that they offered doing it myself and again it was at my pace at my convenience. Uh, another thing that I do is I am a member of the eMaster Camps forum on the web which is a huge resource and knowledge base for anybody using MasterCam. I definitely re recommend that they sign up and get online. Another nice feature about MasterCam is the post. It comes with generic posts that work right out of the box. You can start producing code. Uh, another nice thing about it is that it's, if you have any understanding of programming, you can get in there and figure out how to make these posts work to specific needs that you have. You can modify them to put out safety blocks the way you want to see it, tool changes the way you want to see it. And the things that are above and beyond you, your VAR can actually fix it for you pretty damn quick. The majority of our parts are microwave parts and they're very small. Uh, we use a lot of like 5,000 diameter end mills, maybe 20,000 diameter end mills. The crucial thing about these parts is that they cannot be deburred, they cannot have a burr. So the tool path is critical to the manufacture of a good part. Uh, with MasterCam, it's so flexible that we can tell it how we want to machine it. It's not left up to a standard package where they figure out how a pocket should be, or they figure out how a profile should be. And uh, with that, you end up with burrs. With MasterCam, we tell it how we want it made, and that's the way it comes out.